Well, we're going to focus on our first match of the day. And it is England versus Malaysia. It's Sarah Jane Curry against Also a very good mover, yeah. Subramanian. You can see through the middle of the court how light she is on her feet, recovers well. That's, That's a perfect weight shot into the back of the court. So it's not the first time we've seen an outright winner on the length. She's pretty dangerous in that corner. Two point lead now for Subramanian. Well, clinically converted by Sarah Jane Perry. Loose ball, Perry is one of the best yeah. ashes. <laughs> I think what I like about her game so far is that she has that power, but she's also got amazing hands. At the front. Should she wish to use them? Oh, she's left the ball loose. She's got punished a couple of times there by the early ball from Perry on the forehand side. Here's a chance. It's a great hold. hold. What a hold. Yeah, really good. The young Malaysian has thrown down the gauntlet here. He's taking this first game 12-10. Brilliant control, good threat and use of the hold. And that made the court big enough for Perry not to get that drop shot. Certainly that. rattles some she points can, off. can, not she? No, pretty, I don't think I've got an Aussie accent. <laughs> I can't hit the ball, she's just bang me in. Why she stopped? Oh, that is a dangerous, no dangerous so move, dodgy. yeah. That's schoolboy no, stuff. No, no. Can't believe she stopped. It might be so bad, but she won't do that again. That was a, s a ridiculous thing to do, to stop on that. Yeah, you can't stop on that. It's judged as minimal interference. You've got to go through. Yeah. Nice shot from Perry, taking control of the middle of the court. She was telling herself, why have you been doing this <laughs> the whole know, time? exactly, yeah, that, Incredible, isn't it? Only takes a yeah. slight drop off and yeah. it makes a huge difference. This is unbelievable skill, this from Perry. Look at that, just yeah. dropping the racket. And then you know the intensity you need to practice at mentally and physically. And then you slowly adjust and it, and it starts to build. Yeah. Well, Perry will walk off the court much more content than she was after the first two. She's taken that one, she was in control. 11 6. Behind now. So it seems like it's lit the fire in Subramanium. She's ramped it up a bit here. She's certainly a feisty little <laughs> character on the court, isn't she? She's not shy in putting in her two cents. Determined from Sarah Jane Perry. 
Nicely put away from there. Three match balls there for Perry. Dangerous. Oh my goodness, she's good up there. So relaxed. How easy the swing is. She's not going away, is she? Super Malian. Well, another attacking shot from Subramaniam. Just wanting it a tiny bit too much, I think. Glorious chance here for Perry. Can she yeah. close out? She can. The ball forced into the tin by the young Malaysian player. Brilliant squash. Thoroughly entertaining first match of the day here. Really did enjoy that one. We're going to see so much more from Subramanian when she finishes college and turns professional. But for now, it's Sarah Jane Perry, the number six seed, safely through in 48 minutes. She's taking it 3-1. That's a great shot from Joel King. Five. Slotted away. Yeah, she's getting back into this game. Good to see. A bit yep. of that cushion that she built up. Do oh. find it amazing the runs of points that players get on and what happens is when someone's eked out that lead. But what she's done really well here is getting Joel King out of her comfort zone in the middle of the court, with the exception of that one and that one. She's really, <laughs> she's really trying to stretch King. But that mid court is so dangerous for the New Zealand woman. Well, the trickle boast Seven. has finished off this Seven. first game. Seven. Nicely taken Seven. out here Seven. by El Arabi. Again, so positive, just firing the ball in towards the nick at any opportunity. So Bang. Yeah, so King is so lethal. Both of those winners coming from that strong position in the centre of the court, the forehand volley. Yeah, nicely finished. It was the threat that was there, and it put El Arabi onto her heels and then gave her no chance of recovering to the front. Still three game balls. Down. 11 7. Game to King. One game all. <coughs> well, it's a good effort from Joel King to level out this match. Taking the second game at 11 7. Subramaniam did really well coming back at her and sort of regrouped. Yeah, most definitely. Strings. No let. And out one six. She's slightly more conservative with her play in this match, in this game, and because she's a little bit tens tentative to take that ball in, she's not getting Joel King to the front of the court on her terms. Oh, it's That's a good. brilliant shot. Yeah. A couple of those now from Nine, King. One. I always think that's a sign of King being pretty relaxed on the court if that backhand drop is. Oh, it's lovely. 
Game to Good finish there from King, but again up in front on the volley. Cutting, closing court down, cutting the ball cross court. Okay. We've I'll all um, moved on. Yeah, well, I'll ask John Mazzarella to explain that to you um, over dinner tonight. Please don't. Please don't. Asked to, be asked to be put away there, sitting up nicely on the short line. Well, that is a kill and a half. And out, seven, that eight. bounced three times before the short yeah. line. So hard to do this. Whack. Dodgy. King clinging on, hanging in there for dear life. She can't do any more. She's been undone well, with the boast. Al -Arabi, it was all, all about the El Arabi boast at the back end of this game. Down. Well, a good Hand out, kill from four, King. Seven. I feel like this is a bit of a last stand for her in this game. Six, eight. Well, she's within two points here, fighting away. Oh. It's the boast she's again. Done it. Yep. Hand out, nine, six. Joel King's going to have nightmares about that boast this evening. Oh, she's absolutely thumped it in. Match to El Arabi. Three games well, she had to two. come back from the brink. She had to save match Arabi balls. Seven. She seven did that, and then she's taken two the fifth game. 12, 10, Incredible eight. stuff, really, from the youngster. Great battling spirit. She's knocked out Joel King. 55 minutes in duration. 3-2 to Ron El Arabi. She's taken out number five seed. Brilliant shot, nicely finished. She's looking in Three fine one. fettle here, El Walili. Okay. Yeah, nice finish again. She, she's really found her range in short, right from the first and rally. Six Look two. at the frustration on Adele there. Seven ball. game balls to El Walili. Oh, she's ready. It's all going the Enigma's way here. Slightly fortunate with that follow-up volley. Just hitting the frame. Only five minutes for that first game. 11-3. She's looking very fast, she is, I mean, the fact that she's getting these balls yeah. back. That's good attacks from Adele. Ali Anwar Raider is in and her corner speaking all. to her in between games. See that? She's so quick to get that attacking forehand volley of Adele's. Hand out, 4 10, game ball. Still six game balls here for El Walili. Yeah, it's good from Adele. Good play. I like that. The combination of the boast and the follow-up. She's frustrated, but that's a frustration, yeah. I know she's frustrated, but that's all she can do is keep playing her best yeah. squash, do what she can, and who knows if there's a slight drop-off, she'll be in. 
Well, that's what used to happen, didn't it, with El Walili? Yeah, that's the why people I, would weather it, weather it, hope, oh, hope for the drop off, and uh, it it's not coming though. These these last couple of matches and tournaments. That's gonna be a stroke, isn't it? Well, that's why the Enigma isn't so quite so apt know, these yeah, days, is it? We need a new one. Eleven five. Yeah, she's she's uh, less than Enigma, more the solid. Yep. Eleven five for Renee Melwalili. Seven minutes. We see the mind going a little bit. But I think that's off. A, but you made the point off air when you said in between games she was already on court bouncing around, yeah. driving the ball like a like a jack in the box. I think you said, didn't you? Is that or you something said? like that. Yeah. Egyptian jumping beam. Yeah. <laughs> five love. Again, it's a, another fine finish on the forehand side. Nine four. Six match balls for El Walili. That is that, an absolute masterclass from Rene Melwalili, the defending champion and world number one. Ridiculously impressive performance from her against a very dangerous opponent. She's absolutely dismantled her in 22 minutes. Rene Melwalili, the victor over Yathra Badal, three love. Let's see. It's Hania El Hamami, the 14 seed, up against number four seed and compatriot Noor El Tayeb. Is a wicked Nobody shot. Saw that. Great shot from El Tayeb. Winding up, dropping the shoulder. <laughs> well, her mammy trying to kickstart her charge and challenge here. Slides into ball. three game balls. Uh, she's uh, finished that one off, put it straight in the nick. Tayeb. Tayeb leads one game to love. Absolutely slotting it on the volley. Wonderful. I feel like Hania oh, Hamami's doing that really well in those front left-hand corners, getting low yeah, into the launch to, to play the counter drop from a very solid base. Yep. Oh, it wasn't on. Well, it wasn't on then. Yeah, this is off balance. When you're off balance, you've got to realise that you, you have to defend the situation yeah. more, don't you? The movement's just starting to go a bit from El Hamami. It just looks slightly more scrappy than it did earlier. Yeah, that's what I mean. How do you sustain that level of hitting and energy? Oh, she's missed it. Bit 11, snatchy. Seven. Game to go regroup slightly. Leads two games to love. Oh, what a dive. Perfect lob with the dive. 
That's incredible from El Tayeb. Yeah, she'd steered away from that diving, and then we saw a good few in San Francisco last week. I think yeah, she, well, she bothered resist, her hip a bit, she? though. It's a great opening rally, this. Yeah. It had to hurt. Yep. It had, that was going to do some serious damage. Oh, <laughs> she's absolutely Ridiculous. slotted it. What a shot. Ridiculous. From the right box. Five, two. There we go. There it is. That was such a, a typical rally. She was, she was the terrier that she was. It's one of those ones, Ashley, where I think, I think that extra pace that El Hamami is playing at, it is an asset to have, but not all the time. And and she hasn't quite found her balance yet yeah. of, of when to use it and keep using it, and then when to just slow it down and. I think once Five, she gets seven. that variation back and settles down with it slightly more, yeah. I think it will definitely move her on another notch. You know. Stroke to tie up. Match to tie up. Three games to love. Well, there you go. Business like performance from Noel Tayeb. And yeah, oh, Hamami looking to play at pace, 11, seven, throwing 11, everything 7, at 11, her, 8. but maybe just losing a little bit of control with that pace. And it's Noor El with a very disciplined performance who comes through three love.